Hey, thanks for checking out Nuts and Bolts with Tone. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. With the holidays coming up, I have put together a list of some things that I think will be fantastic in a stocking for the professional mechanic, the DIY guy, or just the dad who likes to work on his son's car. Let's go check it out. All right, the first thing we have is this CRKT uh, folding pocket knife. I actually have this pocket knife. My, my oldest son bought it for me for Christmas last year, and I love it. It's got a very sharp blade, and because it's got such a sharp blade, it actually has two different um, locking uh, safeties, so you don't accidentally close the blade and hurt yourself. So I strongly recommend this. It's a great pocket knife fantastic it's got the serrated blade right here uh in case you needed to cut down a tree <laughs> so there you go there's that one there and i will have this in a in the description down below as well now this one right here is by streamlight streamlight is the pioneer of flashlights rechargeable lights uh we've been using those i've been using streamlight uh streamlight for my entire career so this is a pocket um, it's a pocket flashlight and it's a rechargeable light. You clip it on your keychain right there. I have one on mine and I just recently bought one for my wife and for my oldest son. Uh, and then when my little kids get bigger, I will get them one as well. So this is a great, uh, keychain flashlight and not just for your mechanic. This is great for your wife. This is great for your daughter, your son, anyone who carries around a keychain, it's got, I think, two different modes for the flashlight. This is a fantastic little light, and it's very bright. Now, this right here, I have horrible hands. My hands are always dry. They're always cracked. You know, I'm working with the oil, the diesel, everything, and my hands are just in a bad place most of the time. And so I actually uh, first found this at the... Um, at the boot store where I buy my boots and they actually have one for your feet which I'll show you next this stuff right here you put this on your hands before you go to bed put on your hands your knees whatever it is that you need to you know to get to not be cracked and, and hurting and let me tell you this right here works fantastic you will not be disappointed now this is the one for the feet now I'll tell you what we have our feet in boots, steel toe boots, tall boots, short boots, cold, wet, all kinds of different kinds of conditions. And uh, let me tell you, if you put this on your feet every night, your feet will feel so good. And it, in the morning, they will feel fantastic. So trust me, I have this and the healthy hands in my nightstand and I put it on every night. All right, so no matter where you live, if you live in California, uh, where it gets, you know, kind of cold in the winter, well, really cold for us, 32 is freezing for us. Uh, well, 32 is freezing literally, <laughs> uh, but it's super cold here in California. But, you know, I, I don't want to take away from my friends who live in the East Coast and Canada and everywhere else where it gets well closer to zero and below and everything else. So everyone needs a beanie. Uh, I have a black one and a blue one of this Carhartt beanie in my box. Uh, I keep one in my box. Oh, I keep two in my box. That way when I bring one home to wash it, I have another one. Or if I get diesel fuel on it. So Carhartt is a great brand. They make great clothes. They are the pioneer of work clothes. So their beanies are fantastic. So every mechanic needs a speaker. Uh, sometimes we get stuck working outside. Uh, maybe you're a mobile guy and you're always outside. Um, sometimes we're outside, sometimes we're off where we can't be near our, our toolbox, where we have our stereo. And so this right here, JBL is a leader in, in speakers and, you know, uh, all that kind of stuff. So they make a fantastic speaker. My coworker has one of these and he walks around with it clipped on his belt sometimes or hanging from his toolbox when he's moving uh, around. So this right here is a great speaker. You connect to your phone and you can hook up to your Pandora, your YouTube music, your Spotify, whatever. And we can get going because music keeps us going. Now the next two kind of go, uh, you can get one or the other. Now this is a coffee warmer. 
So you can put your coffee cup on there and keep your coffee warm uh, if you don't use a travel mug. Uh, if you use a travel mug, I guess it would just keep it warmer, but kind of defeats the purpose. So this right here uh, would work great. Uh, my wife has one upstairs and she puts it in the bathroom while she gets ready so it doesn't get cold. Uh, but this is one uh, that you could get and keep the cup of coffee warm or we could go to the next option and that is the Yeti. Now the Yeti is a leader in hot and cold drinks in just flat out uh, making drinks stay however they need to be. If they need to be cold, hot, whatever. So this is a great mug right here. Uh, you could put a little more coffee in there too. So this is great. You could uh, fill up on the way to work, uh, and then you got coffee all day. You get to work, make you know, make a cup of cup, make a couple cups of coffee, or if you have a pot of coffee, you know, pour some in there, keep it warm. So there you go. This keeps you going. Now, if you've ever watched any of my videos or sometimes seen even any of my social media posts, you know that I love paint markers. I use paint markers to mark timing belts, to mark hoses. Uh, if I've got three vacuum lines uh, that, that go in a certain order, I will label them one, two, three. I'll put different colored paint marker. Sometimes I've got five different colors of paint marker on a car because I don't want to take a chance on messing up and put it back together wrong or sitting there trying to figure out where it goes. So this right here, and what is so important about this is where it says oil-based paint marker. That means that the hose can have a little bit of oil on there and you can still write on there. It will still work. I've been using this same paint marker for years. I went through a lot of different brands before I found one that worked and stayed working. As we're coming into the winter time, this is a little more important than in the summertime, but you're going to want to find a good sock that will keep your feet dry. These are dry tech moisture controlled crew socks by Dickies. Dickies is a great company. Uh, they make my mechanics belt. Uh, so this is a good idea right here. Remember, we wear steel toe boots all day long or tall boots, short boots. We're out on the concrete floor for 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 hours a day. So we need our feet to be comfortable. Now the next one is, now this is a tricky one. I, I kind of went back and forth about which one to recommend. There are packs where you have the the more, so this is the one and a half, three pound, 10 pound, and 15 pound. I thought this one was pretty good. Uh, they actually make a uh, right here, which is a 10, 15, and 20 pound one. So in the link, it will be a link to this one right here. But you can also, but in this link, you'll be able to select the different ones. Uh, you could even select a three pound, 20 pound. Uh, I would probably recommend that one, the first one. The uh, the one and a half, three, ten, and fifteen. That's a pretty good one right there. So, and remember, all these links will be down below in the description. I got all carried away in the sizes of the magnets. Uh, these are telescoping magnets. So when you drop your bolt or when you drop your ten millimeter socket and you can't find it, uh, you got these magnets to find it. The next one is a pocket screwdriver slash uh, mini pry bar. So we use these pocket screwdrivers to disconnect connectors, undo little tiny screws. And so we've used these for years, you know, pocket screwdrivers. This is a great kit because it's got uh, two of each. But now they have these curved pry bars. They're like little, they're called little pocket pry bars because it's kind of angled like a pry bar. It's got a nice little handle to hold on to and a little clip to put it in your pocket. So right there, uh, it's a great, great idea. Never ever will work on something and not need a pocket screwdriver and the pocket pry bar is something extra that just comes in handy. So the last one is really important. So those other magnets, they telescope and that means that they, they come out in a straight line and go right back in a straight line. Now this is for those times where it's just not a straight shot. 
and you're trying to shove a magnet down a hole just to try to find something and you just can't find it. This is a bendable magnet. And this one is, uh, it's 21 and 9 16 long and it holds one and a half pounds. So it's a pretty good magnet uh, and it's bendable. So it's very, very important. All right, the very last thing, it kind of goes along with the, with the magnets. So we're using the bendable magnets and the telescoping magnets to find the bolts that we dropped, to find the nuts that we dropped, or to find our 10 millimeter socket that we dropped. Now this is from Carbine Tools, it's brand new. Um, this right here, it has a 10 millimeter socket built into it. So if you have this, you'll never lose your 10 millimeter socket. Right there, it's got a 10 mil, and on this side, it's got a bit driver. So you can see right there the bit driver. You can see right there the 10 millimeter. I've used this and it has come in clutch. This is a great tool for the stocking for anyone. The professional mechanic, the dad at home, the DIYer. This is what you need right here from Carbine Tools. Lifetime warranty, family owned company. I hope you found some great ideas for stocking stuffers. Let me know in the comments below what are your favorites. In the, in the description below, there will be a link to all these items. Thanks for watching the video. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell so you're notified of all my future content, which you definitely don't want to miss. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.